Hi there, Zam here for No Budget Productions and NerdTube. This is my TikTok review of Titan Season 3, Episode 1, 2 and 3. Spoilers ahead. So, I just want to say straight off the bat that Season 3 for me has be- become a far better season than the previous one simply because the pacing is just so fucking good for this show. No bullshit origin stories, no bullshit flashback episodes, no bullshit melodrama. It's really good to see. It's really good to see an, an established team together. These guys are superheroes. They are famous superheroes as well. You know, they do, they do press meetings and speak to journalists and stuff like that. I love it. In the first episode, we do see the death of Jason Todd. Jason Todd gets killed by the Joker and in turn, Bruce Wayne kills the Joker. Bruce Wayne and Joker were only conduits. They were never really major parts of this whole season they were just there to get the ball rolling because it's really about Jason Todd becoming the Red Hood and we see that Jason Todd that is as the Red Hood in the second episode no you know dilly dallying you know after five episodes we finally he finally becomes the Red Hood no he becomes the Red Hood in the second episode how does he get resurrected we have no fucking idea because it was established that he was murdered so it's very unusual to uh, to not know how he's being resurrected but I'm sure we'll get that down the line in the later episodes Jason Todd as well, I'll be referring to him as Red Hood and Jason Todd, um, it's become a criminal mastermind, which is very bizarre because he is a fucking hard ass. he knows how to fucking kick ass, but a criminal mastermind, I'm not so sure so soon, it felt a bit weird, didn't feel organic enough, but nevertheless he's got the fucking criminals of Gotham under his thumb by telling them, look, Batman's gone because Bruce Wayne did decide to disappear after killing the Joker, and because of that, Red Hood is going to be running the fucking organised crime of Gotham. In the third episode, um, we also get Hawk having an attachment put in his chest by by the Red Hood. And if uh, the rest of the Titans don't follow his instructions, that device will be set off. And eventually, unfortunately for uh, Hawk, that device does get set off and he does get killed in the third episode. Something I wasn't expecting. I really thought they were going to save his life. But no, he does get killed. And unfortunately, Dove is the one who kills him by trying to kill red hood she accidentally sets off a detonator which kills hawk yeah amazing stuff we also get um commissioner barbara gordon in this show so far she's in a wheelchair and we also get dr crane aka the scarecrow he's pretty much a stoner version of hannibal lecter and i love it it's gonna be very interesting to see where we go forward with this now hawk is dead it's going to be very sad times in the next few episodes but let me know what you think i think the show is paced really well and i love it don't forget to uh, subscribe to no budget productions as well as nerd tube we are the greatest youtube channel you've never heard of thank you and bye bye <laughs>